how did you get into this world of entrepreneurship? I grew up, uh, I, I'm turning 65 in a couple of weeks. So um, it's a big milestone for me. I don't know if anybody else has experienced this, who's listening to this right now, but to me, it's a huge milestone. And, um, you know, my mother barely lived past this age and I wanted to have a, and she was never happy. So I wanted to have a much more fulfilling life. But as I was growing up, you know, and it's still, I think um, it, the culture is just now changing, hopefully. Um, and I want to be part of that change. When I was growing up, you were told you get a corporate job. This is what success means. You get a corporate job. You stay there until your retirement age. You retire and then you can be happy. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's literally get a, get a degree, get a corporate job, stay there till you retire and then you can be happy. And I bought fully into it. And I got a job at Fortune 500 company and worked my way up through there, uh, got my degrees. And at the age of 40, I had not been promoted for several years. And I went to my boss and asked why. And he was pissed. And that's usually how he talked to me. Like I'm a little child and I was 40 years old. And, you know, like I was somebody just to talk down to all the time. And he said, do you really want to know? And I said, yes, I really want to know. And he said, you laugh and smile too much. And until you change that, you're never going anywhere further. And you, you've hit the ceiling. Wow. You're done. Yeah. Wow. So in other words, his definition of success is she can't be happy. <laughs> exactly. He was miserable. You know, everybody, honestly, looking back at the time, I thought, oh my gosh, I could never leave this company. All my colleagues are here. Security is here. Oh, I've learned so much since then. 